Rakata Yahweh. Rakata Yahweh. Rakata Yahweh. Rakata Yahweh. First and foremost, we want to give more praises and glory and honor to Yahweh. Bashem Yahweh. Bashem Kodash Raka. Double honor to the apostles and elders who rule well a great millstone. And a blessed sanitation to the Akiyam, to the folk, and the to push in the gospel and sincerity in Jude Shalom. This evening, we come the next lesson to feed the elect. You know, this is our brother Yahawada. This is brother Korah. You know, we come to, you know, to, to, to speak on this prophecy. You know, one, one of the next prophecy that will come to pass is the famine. Damn. Right? A great famine coming to this land. Now, now, not only the famine of food, but the famine of the world too. It's going to come. Because when, when, when the Most High elects seal, the Most High going to take his men off the, off the streets. You know, the Most High going to allow Isa to delete this video off of YouTube. You know? And to shut down the internet, right? But we want to speak on the on the famine that come in, right? Famine of food, shortage of food, you know. And there's that 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 hand right now. We could we could see it. We could see. Look what going on in Puerto Rico. Look what going on in Venezuela, right? We could see this famine come in. These islands will get hit. Dominica. All these islands will get hit with, with these hurricane. Houston. You know they have, they, they, they have them in this shelter feeding them so this famine coming they're gonna be worldwide right and you see it let's remember the uh, rebel, um first first corinthians 14 and 1. this is first corinthians 14 verse 1. he said follow after charity and desire spiritual gift but rather that he may prophesy. 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 Yeah. So, this, we, we the time of prophecy, as our el, beloved elder say, Apostle Tahar, we, this is the year of prophecy, so we the time of prophecy. So, we speaking of this prophecy. We telling, we telling these, these, these things before it happened. Because the Mosai Yahweh Bashem Yahshem revealed these secrets to the prophets. So, we telling these things before it happened, and a famine coming. And a lot of you niggas gonna die from hunger. A lot of you nigga women gonna die from hunger, you and your children, because you refuse to hearken unto your how Hashem Yahweh Shai. A lot of these children who gonna die from hunger, you know, in the they, there's a judgment for what they did in the past life. You know, this for the brothers and you know who understand the reincarnation, who understand that you do live more than once. You know, a lot of these kids gonna die from hunger. And you might say, Oh, how you can say these things? But there's there's the judgment of your how Hashem Yahweh Shai. You know, for what they did in the past life, he sent them back in this life to our face the judgment. And a lot of you niggas gonna die by hunger. Because you refuse to turn back to your wash and your shy. Right? Yeah, get the second engine, right? Eh? Yeah. Second engine was nine. Second engine was nine was one. No, that's after fifteen. Fifteen was one. Lucky. Second Ezra 9, 15? No, 15, 15 yeah, so. Second Ezra 15 verse 1. He said, Behold, speak thou in the ears of my people the word of prophecy which I will put in their mouth. So this is lessons about tonight, you know. Father put the spirit on me, this brother, to do this lesson. So we speak it, we put the most I put the word, prophet, the word of prophecy in our mouth to speak these words. But then tell you, tell you so God Negroes, Latins and Native American Indian. That a famine coming, a great famine. You know, it coming, and the men, the Lord, we can see it. You know, look in your grocery and see what, how much food they got there. If the, if the, if the, uh, your port shut down for two days, what thing gonna happen? All the food in the grocery gonna run out. And when the, and when the food run out, where 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 you getting where you getting food from? Because at, at most of these countries import. They don't, they, they, don't, they don't do their own agriculture and they import food, you know, and this famine come in, right? So the most I said, speak the word of prophecy, this is we telling you people, your famine come in, right? A lot of people going to die from hunger, a lot of you people going to eat your children, eat your woman, eat your man, right? Eat your neighbor, right? This is what going to happen, can the scripture say it, right? right. These so called Negroes, Latinos, and natives, you know, what do they want to repent back onto your Abasham, your Shai? You all want to continue in wickedness, you know, and die by the Mosai bringing these plagues upon the world, Can't. you know. So there's um, 2nd Ezra 15, verse 27. 
He said, For now are the plagues come upon the whole earth, and he shall remain in them. For power shall not deliver you, because you have sinned against him. Yeah, all the sin against the most high, you know, all they want to be up in these hallowed house, you know, all they want to eat pork, you know, despite all their heritage, you know. To follow after these devils, you know. Well, Damn. scripture says, learn not the ways of the heathen. Damn. You know, and all they follow these customs of these devils and liking, liking it best of all, you know. That yeah, beautiful precept, right? Yeah. The yeah. back of the we can get Ezekiel 14 and, and 13, the back of we got to transgress against the most high. And they refuse. They refuse to turn away from sin. Yeah. You know? This is Ezekiel 14, chapter 13. Can. He says, son of, son of man, when the Lamb sinneth against me by trespassing previously, Can. then will I stretch out my hand upon it and will break the staff of the bread Can. thereof and will send famine upon it and will cut off man and beast from it. Most I see you break the staff for what? Bread. Yeah. The most I see you bring a famine. The most I gonna cut the bread from coming in. The most I gonna cut that bread from coming in. Like what happening right now in Puerto Rico, Venezuela, and certain parts of the certain part of the world, you see famine a lot of people hungry. Right? Especially these islands will get hit. Like British Virgin Island, um Bermuda, um Dominica. You see what going on in this place? The most I see can break the staff of the bread and that's exactly what can happen. Famine come in cow, you sin against him. This, this message to you, you this, this word is to you so can Negroes, Latins and Native American Indian. You gotta turn away from the ways of this society, from the ways of this life. You know, this world about to be destroyed. When we said this world is so called white man rulership. This wick wickedness about to come to an end. So before the most high destroy a place, he give a warning. And what's the one? He made the Lord one. You people blow the trumpet. Prepare yourself. Prepare yourself to be under the covering of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai to be delivered from this evil that come in. And famine is one of the evil. Okay. Right? Yeah. yeah. You, know, you all so stiff naked, you know, you all don't want to turn, turn back. Okay. You all want to continue in sin. You know, continue in wickedness. You know, then, um, I preach to bring out today, 2 Tezra 16, 19 and 20. He said, Behold, famine and plagues, tribulation and anguish are sent as scourges for amendment. Good. But for all these things, they shall not turn from their wickedness. So the most I say, he sent he send these this plagues for amendment. Amendment, you will check yourself. Yeah. Check yourself, ask yourself why this thing happened to you. And repent from your wicked way. The most I said, this thing for you, check yourself, for you, take heed, or for you, consider. But the scripture says, the most I say, yeah, you don't consider. Two thirds of people don't consider. The word of men with me hey, check yourself, why this thing happening? Right? You see what? You see, but for all these things, they shall not turn from their wickedness. Exactly. Not be always mindful of the scourges. They're not going to be mindful of it because when the most I said, why is tricking you people anymore? You revolt more and more. The more the most I put you on, and y'all is more you are revolting. So, what, what the most I left for do? The most I going to kill y'all niggas. That's what the most I can do. The most I gonna put you niggas to death. Because you're not taking heed the times. You're not taking heed the times that we in. Right? You, you want to see my um, Ezekiel um uh you read from I think it's twenty. We just read on uh, Ezekiel fourteen and thirteen. Uh yeah um, read from twenty one. Ezekiel 14 verse 21. Yeah. He said, For thus said how power, yeah. how much more when I send my four scores judgment upon Jerusalem, the sword and the famine, and the noisome beast. Yeah, evil, you know, pestilence, famine, the four score judgment on Jerusalem. I know you you dumb niggas might think he's speaking about the land of Jerusalem. No, speaking about you Israelites. You so can Negroes, Latins, and Native American Indians because Jerusalem is a people before a place. Can. Yeah. Right? So these, there's, 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 these are cold words. Right? And the scripture says, like here, the scripture says, only judgment shall start at the house of Israel. Can. So the most I deal with you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native. Can. You know? Yeah. 
So you 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 people you people you people gonna be destroyed. Get the lamentation for and um and if you get anything you can break it out though. Yeah, get the lamentation for and um nine. Four verse nine. He said, "They that be slain with the sword are better than they that be slain with the hump. For these pine away stricken through for want of the fruit of the field." So the Most High said, "They that be killed with the sword is better than they that that, by, that, that be slain by hunger. That's a brutal death. That's a brutal way to go out." And a lot of you niggas gonna die brutal death because you are walking great pride. <coughs> you know, you wanna call yourself Rastafarian, you wanna call yourself Muslim, you wanna call yourself uh, you are conscious, come the conscious community, you wanna call yourself Christian, Baptist, you name it. And these 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 doctrines, philosophy, religions of the heathens. So the most I say you are walking great pride. Great pride is why the most I said great misery gonna be done. And the famine is the famine is one of the great misery gonna done be done upon you niggas. Um. Right? They now got no more KFC out here, no more Royal Castle, no more double stand, gyro stand, you know, Chinese restaurant. Now got these things out here. They can be chaos. They can be chaos out here. Right? People, people gonna be killed for what they got. People gonna raid your house and kill you for your food. A lot of you gonna eat one another, cannibalism. You are gonna eat one another. Right? There's yeah. a, you have something there? Yeah, yeah this, is, this is Baruch 2, verse 25 and 26. He say, And lo, they are cast out to the heat of the day and to the frost of the night. Right. And they die in great misery by famine, by sword, and by pestilence. You see, and the house, and the house which is called by thy name, thou hast laid waste, as it is to be seen this day for their wickedness of the house of Israel and the house of Judah. Yeah, the Israelites, you Latino tribes, you native, and you, and you, you so-called Negroes, the house of Israel and the house of Judah, is one family, right? The most I say for your wickedness, the most I see can destroy you for your wickedness. Right, uh, Zach, uh, Zach, Zach, uh, Zachariah 11 and 9. Most I can destroy you after your wickedness. This is Zachariah 11 verse 9. He said, Then said I, Will not feed you that that diet. Most I see not gonna feed you. How you think you niggas eat when the day comes? Is it most I provide? How you think you niggas get 9 to 5? Is it most I give you that? How you think you niggas get strength to do what you gotta do? It's the most I give you everything. Everything comes from the most I. So when the most I see you're not gonna feed you niggas, you're gonna die by hunger. Because you are being proud against your maker. Salvation is to you Israelites, you so can niggas, Latin and Native American Indian. But you, you niggas don't want salvation. You niggas don't want to rule. Y'all don't want to come out of this captivity. So the most I see, no, you're not gonna feed y'all. They are going to die. Yeah, so how many times you? Yeah, he said, then, then said I, I will not feed you. Can. That that diet, Can. Let, let it die, and Can. that that is to be cut off, let it be cut off. Can. And let the rest eat everyone the flesh of another. Let everyone eat the flesh of another. Right, Jeremiah 19 and 9. Let everyone eat the flesh of another cannibalism. This is what you niggas going to turn to. All you big fat mumpy who can't run, you have to be <laughs> you have to be in some pillow. <laughs> yeah. It's in the scriptures, that's what come in. All will be stew. Exactly, that's what come in. Right? Jeremiah 19 verse 9. And I will cause them to eat the flesh of their sons. This is what the most I say. You're gonna cause you have to eat the flesh of your sons. This happened in 70 AD. And it can happen again. When the Roman besieged Jerusalem, he was eating leather belt, he was eating shoes, he was eating the children. It can happen again. Because you niggas proud. Especially you scoffers. 
you Christians who want to come against the word of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah, you see it. The most I see in everything, you know? the most I see in it, you know, but you are looking at we as no with bombs, you know, with nobody, you know. But before the most I destroy a place, before the most I destroy a kingdom, we do we send the men out, right? And we 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 blow the trumpet in Zion and let you people know that yo we need time of war destruction coming right yeah go ahead you got something yeah they, um, yeah, they didn't go after that yeah they second Ezra yeah. 15 verse 26 yeah. he said for Yahweh know it all them that sin against him Can. and therefore deliver he them unto death and destruction death and destruction so when 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 it when you when you when you reprobate here the most I know all who had sinned against him, you can say everybody sinned against the most high. That is correct. But it's speaking about the ones who refuse to turn away from the sins. That's what it's speaking about. The one who refuse to, to, to stop sinning against the most high. What is the sin when you break the most high laws? The most high speaking about the ones who refuse because each and every one of we for a shark. But the many love and humble herself. They gonna humble yourself. The most I call, the most I call Jacob a worm. A worm. So we gonna the many Lord, we gonna humble ourselves. And we gonna we gonna confess our sins to the Heavenly Father. And we're gonna beg him for forgive forgive us. And we gonna turn away from no wick no wickedness. But you niggas gonna die by hunger. Right? Yeah, go ahead. Talk about me. You see, um, Jeremiah 19, 9, you see, and yeah. I will cause them to eat the flesh of their sons. That's what the most I see can do in cause they have to eat the flesh of your sons. This is why this is why Yahweh Shai said, What woe to them with child? In this time, woe to you, nigga woman with child. Right? And they say you're gonna make a lot of y'all, a lot of y'all niggas gonna run and take the chip. The Michael chip. That's our next prophecy. That's a, that's one of the one of the major prophecies gonna come to pass. As the scripture say, if I say many of you people will take the chip willingly. Can. Right? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, you see, and, and the flesh of their daughters. The flesh of your daughters. The one who you always say you love so much, you're gonna eat them. Yeah, go ahead. And they shall eat every one the flesh of his friend. Yeah. In the siege. Yeah. And straightness wherewith their enemies and they that seek their life shall shall strain it them. Yeah, and that's what come in. When Isa collapsed this economy, the devil is so called white man collapsed this economy. Are you proud niggas here in Trinidad? We think and how many to y'all? When this economy collapse, they're not gonna no food in this place. Are you proud niggas who, 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 got, who, who got all these big fancy job and all these big fancy title? What do you think can happen? Your money that you got to disappear in 10 years, where you can get food from? Eh? I can start eating one another. This is what the most I say, you can eat one another. Right? That's exactly what can happen. Right? You got something there? Eh? Right, just get, get me Jeremiah 15 and 2 figure out the way you think. Yeah, that's what's gonna happen. Y'all gonna start eating one another. Alright? 15 2? Yeah. It's a Jeremiah 15 verse 2. And it shall come to pass if they say unto thee, Whether shall we go forth? Then thou shalt tell them, yeah. Thus said your whole. Yeah. Such as are for death, to death. Yeah, this is what we can tell y'all. Yeah. Because y'all don't want y'all don't want to hearken to the Heavenly Father. Y'all can say, Oh, this is just a book. Y'all is for us prophet. Yeah. Yeah, that's not the man the Lord. But this is what the most I say over tell them, such are what? Death to death. Yeah. And, and such are for the sword. For the sword. To, to the sword. Yeah, go ahead. And such are for the famine to the famine. Yeah, a lot of you niggas gonna die by hunger. And a slow and painful death too. Because you refuse to turn back to your house, Hashem, your house, right? But the man the Lord gonna eat. The man the Lord gonna eat. Right, go ahead. Uh. And such are for the captivity to captivity. Mashallah, FEMA camp. Right? Some of y'all gonna be put in there, be put to death. Some of y'all gonna take the chip. Okay. Right? That's exactly what come in. Right, you got something? Yeah. In Luke, Luke 21, verse 11. Yeah. He say, and great, and great earthquake shall be in diverse places. Great earthquake. The okay, go up in, um, that one in Honduras, yeah. 
and that one the other day in um, Honduras, that one um, recently in um, that one in Russia, that one in the Philistine, that one in um, uh, do a video, I do a video in it that that about 11 to 12 different earthquakes. The other day is about, about as I was, I was, I can't remember the day, but I did the video recently, recently ago. So the most I said, I got great earthquake, and we see in these things, right? Yeah, go ahead. And famine, and pestilence, and fearful signs, and great signs shall there be from the heaven. Yeah, famine, the famine coming, the great sign, the great, we see a sign on the uh, 2000, two, the um, the the 24th of August, there was 2017. We see a solar eclipse. There was a great sign. That sign of destruction. Another great sign that we see. We see those chariots with the world the car and UFO. You people be boggled when you see those things. Don't know what is it. But the many Lord know this. This chariot said, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. And the money collapsing in you know, that petrol Yeah. Right now, the petrol are losing value. On, 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 on the on the global scale losing its value we got china russia these big this 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 big uh superpower country they turn away from the petrodollar right now they're using the un um the yuan the chinese yuan right and they're backing up with gold right so great great misery coming to this place great plagues right and so like your famine is one Isaiah 65 and um, started what was was 12. Says Isaiah 65 verse 12. Yeah. He said, Therefore will I number you to the sword. Yeah, the most I see can number you niggas to the sword and you nigger women too. Who proud. You know who don't want to hearken to your man, who don't want to listen to your man. You know who feel you above man, who feel you don't need a man. You know? Who feel as a man? Yeah, the most I got a number you have to the sword. And are you niggas who be faggot and up in this man, this devil system? I wanna, I wanna bring, especially you wacky ass Christian who wanna bring the heathen our heritage. These heathen are abomination, right? The most I got a number you have to the sword. Don't hand in your hand. The wicked shall not go and punish, right? He shall all bow down to the slaughter. Yeah, he shall all bow down. Because when I call, he did not answer. So how the most I call it through the men and the sons and the highways and by and through this video of pestle. Exhorting you Israelites, you so-called Negroes, Latins and Native American Indian. You know that dwell in the four corners kind of the earth and the confusion of faces, the Israelite foreigners. Right? The most I call on to you right now. The most I show him mercy right now. To turn back onto him, right? Go ahead. He said, he say, but when I speak, he did not hear. Yeah, yeah, I don't want to hear. You're scoffing against the many lost times with the apostles and elders at GMS. You know, they, they, they are the men of the most I set up to be the head of Israel right now. That's right. And you're scoffing against the elders and the, the apostles and the elders. Well, you're going to pay for everything that you do. The most I seen everything. Right? Go ahead. You see, when I speak, he did not hear, yeah. but did evil before my eyes. Evil, scarf against the Most High Word, blaspheme the Most High Word, make mock at the Most High Word. Yeah, go ahead. And did choose that wherein I delighted not. Yeah, the Most High, the Most High choose that. Do you be a scarfer and make mock against the Most High Word? Right? The Most High, didn't, the Most High not delighted in that. Right? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Most I delighted in that. But the most I servant gonna eat. The men the Lord gonna eat. Because the most I say that we're gonna eat. Right? The ravens feed Elijah. They bring meat for him. So the most I say his his servant's gonna eat. But you gonna die. Right? Go ahead. He said, Therefore, thus said your hover power. Yeah. Behold, my servant shall eat. Yeah, his servant, the most the most I say his servant, the men the Lord, the hopefully elect. They're gonna eat. Alright, go ahead. But he shall be hungry. Yeah, but you proud gonna be hungry. And I, especially you nigga woman who's, who, who, who look down look down on the so-called Negroes, Latins and Native American Indian men. 
You know, on the day where you see the eating, you're going to come bow in your head down. You're going to come humble. Because what you're going to want your reproach be taken away from you all. Done. That's when you're going to bow down to the so to, to, to the so called Negro, Latin, and Native American in your man. Right? Yeah, go ahead. Say, Behold, my servant shall drink. Yeah. But he shall be thirsty. Yeah, you niggas going to be thirsty. Who back up against the water you are washing me? You too torn. Going to be destroyed. Yeah. Behold, my servant shall rejoice. Yeah. But he shall be ashamed. Yeah, and most of you say you are going to rejoice. You are going to be ashamed for your ignorance. Right? For your proudness. Yeah. Come with it. You get Joe 5 and um, you close after Joe 5. You forget anything, you bring out if you get anything. Joe 5? You got anything there? Uh -huh. I get Joe 5 and um, Joe 5 and um, Start at verse, um, verse 19. Joe 5 19. Yeah. He shall deliver thee in six troubles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In seven, there shall no evil touch thee. Yeah, seven, in, 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 in seven, right? That means there's the, the total destruction in America the ICBM missile. The most I say, you can deliver me six trouble. The elect can be delivered from their so called chariots. We can be delivered, right? The hopefully elect. He said, in seven, no evil not gonna touch thee. That's when the missile gonna come. Yeah, go ahead. In famine, he shall redeem thee from death. In famine, the most I can redeem is lack from death. So the man in love, we're going to eat in famine. We're going to eat lavish. Are you heathens? Right? Are you heathens? Who suck up all your food? Because you tap, you tap heathens know what's going on. All the, all the food that you are stacking up, all the water, wine, it coming to the elect. We're going to have that in the famine. Yeah, go ahead. And in war from the power of the sword. And go ahead. He said, Thou shalt be hid from the scourges yeah. of the tongue. Yeah. Neither shall thou be afraid of destruction when it cometh. We're not gonna be afraid, but when we can do we say ka hali how ba shem yao shai. Ka we see we seen our enemies going down and we going up, we're gonna rule. Yeah, go ahead. At destruction and famine thou shalt laugh. At destruction and famine we gonna laugh. We gonna laugh, cause we gonna be joyful, salvation, deliverance. All right, go ahead. Neither shall thou be afraid of the beast of the earth. Yeah, we not gonna be afraid of the beast of the earth, cause the beast gonna be the beast gonna be, gonna be obedient unto us. Cause man, he learn our spiritual powers. This when you nigga woman gonna bow down to us. Man, we man, he learn our spiritual powers, right? So we can eat. The many love gonna eat, we just gotta keep this faith, keep doing the work, say, Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, keep pushing on this video, this video, our pastor, keep studying, you know, keep, 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 keep the unity and the love among the brotherhood, you know, keep going to the highways and byways, you understand, keep praying to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, for mercy, you know, for strength, you know, for faith to endure to the end, yeah. right, this is what we gotta keep doing, call out to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, this is what we want us to do. This is exactly what we want to do, to depend on Him. Right? This is what He wants us to do. In order to have the faith, we pray for we pray for more faith, pray for increase in you know, the time of affliction. Right? Anything to say there? Yeah, the, yeah. as Paul said, keep, keep the faith. You Can. know, there we did a, a crown alike, a crown for we. You know, as you should join second as well, that, you know, your shy was placing crowns on the head. Can. You know, and we just had a holy feet and keep strong pushing this wood. Can. 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 sincerity. You know? So, that's Is it? Yeah, I'll bring it to you. 2, 42. Can. He say, And I, Ezra, saw upon Mount Zion a great people whom I could not number, and they all praised Jehovah with songs. Can. And in the midst of them, there was a young man of high stature, taller than all the rest. That's Yahweh Shai, our Lord and Savior. Yeah, go ahead. And upon every one of their heads he set crowns. Can. And was more exalted, which I marvel at greatly. Can there's a man the Lord who will make it, the whole field lick, the hundred and forty four thousand, they can get crumbs in the head. You know, you want third men in the church gonna be safe too. The ones who believe in the man the Lord, you know, you are gonna be delivered too. Right? Is it it? Jonathan was forty seven. Can he says so? He answered and said unto me, It is the Son of God 
whom they have confessed in the world. Yeah, the son of the moon. Sorry, who we confess in the name is Yahweh Shai. Right? Not Jesus. Jesus is not a word. Right? This is the Greek. Right? That's not the name of Messiah. Jesus is a title. John 19, 19. Tell you what Jesus is a title. Del deliverer, Savior. And if you say if you say breaking down the word Jesus, the the, the Shai is in English is Jesus. That's a lie because Yahweh Shai in English gonna mean he save or he deliver. That's what it gonna mean. Alright, go ahead. He said, then began I greatly to commend them that stood so stiffly for the name of the Lord. Can so the stood stiffly. That's why we gotta keep praying. As a pastor rock, as I always say, keep praying. Keep praying. A pastor rockers always say that. Keep praying. You know, with that, we must let us say defying. You want to give our praises, praises and glory and honor to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule with a great stone, and a blessed salutation to the Akyams and the folk and the earth to push in the gospel and sincerity to Jude. Shalom. Shalom.